Hi everybody, this is Kathy Grosskirk with Bookkeeping Clean and Simple here in Austell, Georgia near Metro Atlanta. And we're going to talk about the left navigation today in QuickBooks Desktop. I am actually in the accountants version of one of the sample files. And this is basically universal across most of the newer versions of QuickBooks Desktop, including the 2020 version. So let's go ahead and get started. We have four basic tabs in the left navigation. These you can actually minimize and then they move the icons down here. But you can't really reorder these. But the first area we're going to talk about is my shortcuts. These are the areas where you frequent on a regular basis. So you can customize these to either add or move around whichever ones that you use most frequently in whatever order. As you drag these around, you can see that they move. You can actually go over here and click and add several other ones that you may want to include in here. You can also delete some. Say like if you want to delete out this accountant that I accidentally added in. I'm going to click on delete and that will take that out of there. So let's go ahead and move on to the next area which is our view balances. And this is where you may want to have your short list of the various accounts that you see on a regular basis, such as maybe your checking and savings account and maybe the credit card that you use the most of. And of course, if you uh, keep track of your accounts, payables and receivables, you might want those up there as well. You can also customize to either add bank accounts, add credit card accounts. You can move these up or down if you want to. You can actually remove one. We're going to remove this cash expenditures one. So once I click OK, that'll go away. And as you can see, you want to keep this relevant to what you use on a regular basis. So our next area is going to be our run favorites reports. And as you can see, if you have any favorites chosen, they're going to be listed here. You can also go to the report center from here and search by category. Say like we wanted to go to a sales tab here and we wanted to add a favorite report sales by customer. Once you do that, you see it gets added to the list. And if you changed your mind, you can just click on that hard again to remove that. And it's just as simple as that. So you can also click on the favorites tab to see which favorites you have already saved and you can add and remove that way as well. Our final area is going to be our open windows tab and this right here shows you which windows we have open with the most current one open on top here with our others fall right behind it. If you go up here to the windows and do the cascade button you can see how it kind of aligns them where you can just click on them individually. Say if you wanted to go back to the home page, you can do it that way or you can access it from over here. You can also click on this maximize screen to make it bigger and work with it in a larger view. You could also collapse this pane on the left side to even make it bigger there. And then you can also do the opposite to bring that icon back again or that left navigation back again. So hopefully this will help somebody today. Thank you for watching. I would love it if you would like and subscribe to my channel as well as share it with others. I am adding on average one video per week including the occasional motivational video. I would love nothing more than to help you maximize your usage of QuickBooks Desktop and online. My email is below as well as the number where you can text me for more information and to set up an initial consult. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.